right, welcome back to the channel, everyone. Uh, today I want to do something different. I want to start a new series, and I kind of want to have a spotlight on a certain species. And I plan on doing a video for every species in the game. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do one on rabbits and ducks or not, but um, I might. But anyway, today we're going to start off with the blacktail deer. And I'm just going to tell you little things about the blacktail, some things that are important. Um, the blacktail deer maxes out at level 5. So essentially, that's going to be what you want to look for if you're looking for a diamond. Um, now, I'm not sure if you can get a diamond blacktail a level under. And remember, there's no guarantee that a level 5 will be a diamond. But that's your best bet. Um, so a diamond weight, minimum diamond weight for a blacktail is either 89.5 kilograms or 197 Point thirty-one pounds. So it's a little it's a little weird because the game is meant to be played in uh, kilograms because the uh, the exchange is is kind of messed up. But the weapons that you want to use for the black tail deer for your rifles, you want to use your two four three, your forty five caliber air rifle, and your Solokin, and the thirty thirty. Those are all rifles that you will get full integrity on with this deer. Um, for the handguns, you can use the 357 and you can use the 45 Colt. And you want to use the 420 grain arrows and bolts. Um, the most important thing is, and we're going to go over, is the drink times. Now, I'm not going to put up here feed zones or the rest zones because I feel that those are the least important and are the hardest to find. The easiest way to find animals is to check for drink zones. Um, and these guys drink from 5 in the morning till 10 in the morning and then they drink again from uh, 1700 to 2100 in the evening. And those are the best times uh, you want to get these guys. Um, now, a couple things is that these are a weapons class 2 and whitetail are weapons class 2 but it's kind of like a lower tier, higher tier kind of thing with these. Uh, the blacktail is the lower class, so you can't use the 270 or the 4570 to hunt these. You will not get integrity with the 270 or the 4570. It's very important to understand that. I see a lot of people asking about that, like, you know, why am I shooting blacktail and I'm not getting full integrity? Well, that's why. Um, it's confusing. I did a video all about integrity, but, you know, it's worth mentioning again. So that's all the important information I feel about the blacktail. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the map and I'm going to show you some of my favorite spots to get blacktail. Okay, so my first favorite spot to get blacktail is right up here. Right up at Chopeka. This northern lake up here, you got the uh, Willapeg Outpost. I'm sorry, this is Willapeg. Well, Willapeg, Chopeka. This, uh, this year of the outpost is Willapeg. And across this line, you're in the Chopeka. Now, I've gotten two diamond blacktail right up in here. My first diamond blacktail I ever got was right up over here, which was like a 998. And actually, my second diamond blacktail, which I got for this video, was right out of this tripod stand here. So this, I feel, is a very good spot for blacktail and they seem to that they, they seem to wander down here and they seem to wander over this way as well now another really good spot for blacktail that I've uh, noticed is let's see all the way down here let me zoom out right down here at this Runachi Lake right here this here, this whole lake is just a hotbed of activity for blacktail, elk, and whitetail. But um, right up all along this here line, all the way down to around here, where you see I have a tree stand set up, which is actually where I am right now, um, this is all prime blacktail territory. And my third favorite spot is right here, and this is the famous Mushroom Lake. Um, as you can see, I have a tree stand set up here. I have a tent here. And literally, blacktail are like all around the top of this here. And also right around the bottom of this lake. Right here.
Okay, so that is my kind of uh, spotlight on Blacktail. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was informative. If you feel I missed anything about them, uh, just leave it in the comments. Um, I want to try to make these better, so if there's anything you could think of that you want to know about a certain animal, you know, leave that in the comments too, and in upcoming videos, I'll try to hit on that. And um, I have something really cool to leave you with at the end of the video. Um, this is something that literally I just got into the game. I just started recording, and um, yeah, it was pretty cool. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, we'll see you next time, guys. Okay, so I literally just turned the game on and started recording. I didn't even get my headset plugged in yet, and this guy stepped out, and he's a level 5. I, I can't even believe it. I was so surprised. So, we took him. He went down super easy. There was a couple other ones hanging around. No bucks. Just does. Yeah, that was just a doe. Uh, so yeah, I mean, this was probably one of the craziest things that's ever happened to me in the game. I've never had a diamond just walk right out like that. I thought, how cool was that, that I actually got a diamond out of a tripod stand, which, um, yeah, I've already gotten a diamond out of a tripod stand. But, this is the first diamond I've gotten with the new bow. First diamond I've gotten with tracer arrows. So that's pretty cool. So let's pick them up. See what he is. 968 diamond. So that's kind of a perfect way to to end things here to, to show you exactly what you're striving for if you're looking for a diamond. Five medium. Again, there's no guarantee that a five medium will be a diamond. But it's it's the max level animal. So I mean, you know, that's uh that's what you want to strive for. Alright guys, see you next time.